in that game, though. We have to move on to the next one in Group B. Sierra Leone against Burkino Faso. Not highly fancied. And a crowd of only 2,000 in Bonfontaine for this game. An attack on the left to start off with. And in came Ceci right through the goalkeeper to score the opening goal for Sierra Leone in exactly 10 minutes. 1-0. Much more attacking, and uh, Burkina Faso trying to fight their way back into the game. And the second goal coming up there, the equalizer by Wedragao, with 20 minutes of the game remaining. First time they had competed in this competition, and that was their first goal officially in the African Nations Cup. The joy was short-lived. At the other end, Sierra Leone on the attack. Ball off the post. Scramble clearance. The pressure still on. A beautiful little header there by Callon, which just didn't pay off. Misses at both ends. Tremendous shot there by Palanfo, and Watara should have put it away. The score still remained at that stage, one all. And just before the end, the ball placed in here, no cover. And it went all round the houses there to put the ball in the back of the net. Callan scoring two minutes from the end of that game. The final score, Sierra Leone two, Burkina Faso one. And they saw a game dominated clearly by Algeria. With the ball being played around by Lunici and Saeed. Neat little cross and in came Mekabi. Just on half time to make it 1 0. They had done all the pressing in this game. Rather shot shy in front of goal, but not this time. Into the second half, Sergio Leone had to come forward. They were caught out of the back far too often. And as the ball was played there, Maccabi got his second goal. El Wazani on the far side doing all the work for him. And in he came to finish it off. <laughs> to Zambia against Sierra Leone. A game that almost wasn't played. The 24th of January, Blomfontein, hit by a monsoon. Well, they worked very hard for the benefit of the 500 souls who turned up in this uh, downpour to see this game. And well worth saving because this was to turn out to be a personal triumph for Kalusha Boalia. A man now playing in Mexican football, would you believe? He really should be in Europe with all the skills. Watch this finish. Well, there's an Englishman called Paul Gascoigne who does things like that. That was the first goal in exactly two minutes. He was to show his skills in 
almost a slow motion replay of that first goal. There he is again, same spot, same foot, same net. Two goals in seven minutes. Well, he's now almost a venerable gentleman of 34 years of age, but skill shall not wither. No way back now, and Zambia looking very, very good indeed. Consolidating their place with the Bukis as one of the favorites. And 84 minutes gone, there was a hat trick. As I said, a great personal triumph for Kalusha Bwalia. The way he takes the goalkeeper and the defender on, drags him out of his goal, leaving the goal mercilessly exposed. More to follow as Kenneth Malatoli, despite the fact that he was almost pulled back there, strode through to score the fourth goal. Sierra Leone had been ripped apart. There the star, one of the great players of the tournament.